The 4th of July almost here and millions of Americans are hitting the roads. But before you set off those fireworks, we're on your side with a look at a scorching forecast. Plus, a Richmond couple left searching for answers tonight after a thief swipes their car from right outside their home. And after hitting Jamaica with severe wind and rainfall, Hurricane Barrel continues its path of destruction as a local family makes their escape from its wrath. This is 12 on your side. Things are about to get hot, hot, hot in Central Virginia. With the 4th of July just an hour away, we're staring down the barrel of a first alert weather day. Meteorologist Megan Wise joining us tonight. And Megan, I mean, it's going to be a scorcher, but any chance of rain for those fireworks? Uh, it does look like a lot of this activity will be before fireworks, Riley, which is good news. But we do have that potential for a few showers and storms as we go through the afternoon. Between about 3 to 8 will be the best window, so just keep that in mind. I know many of you will be outside enjoying the 4th of July, but also just make sure you're staying cool. We're talking about our high temperatures uh, topping out in the upper 90s. So the heat returns and also the humidity. So when you factor that in to temperatures in the 90s, our uh, heat index values are going to be anywhere between about 100 to upwards of 105 degrees. So just make sure you're staying cool throughout the day tomorrow. Right now, we are looking at dry conditions on first alert Doppler radar, clear scans.